Health and safety is not exactly a laughing matter, but this Evans Vanadyne training film uses humour to get serious messages across. The character Napo has been created by the HSE and other European organisations to illustrate various health and safety risks. The majority of Evans Vanadyne products are not classified as hazardous. However, you may come into contact with formulated products that are classified as hazardous. You may find these symbols on the back label of some Evans Vanadyne formulated products. The following films will demonstrate how to handle the product safely and avoid accidents within your workplace and at home. Toxic and very toxic. May pose a health risk or even death if inhaled, ingested or if it penetrates the skin. Currently, no Evans Vanadyne products are classified as toxic. Harmful. Substances which have the potential to cause serious damage to health if inhaled, swallowed or absorbed via the skin. Irritant. Non-corrosive substances that have the potential to cause irritation upon contact. <laughs> Right, 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 right
<laughs> Products labelled with a black cross are either harmful or irritant. Products with these symbols may cause skin irritation, itching, dryness and rashes. They can also cause eye damage and breathing difficulties. It may be possible to use an alternative product for the same task that does not carry the hazard symbol. However, if it is necessary to use a product that carries a hazard symbol, ensure that the correct control measures are in place. Corrosive Substances which have the potential to destroy living tissue upon contact. Flammable. Substances covered by this classification include liquids that can ignite at extremely low temperatures. <laughs> Dangerous for the environment. Chemicals which may present an immediate or delayed danger to one or more components of the environment. Oh, my God. 
The following presentation is about the control of substances hazardous to health regulations, or COSH. It does not cover the regulations in detail, but rather provides an overview of the key issues contained within the regulations. Further information should be obtained from the regulation and other appropriate sources. COSH covers chemicals, products containing chemicals, fumes, dusts, vapours, mists and gases, and biological agents, or germs. What does COSH really mean? COSH regulations are designed to stop chemical exposure and reduce risks for people at work. COSH requires risk assessments to be completed where hazards are present. Once trained, you must be aware of the hazards and take suitable precautions to protect yourself from injury. You are responsible for your safety. If safety equipment is provided, it must be used. Read all the instructions and note the hazard warning symbols. Always use chemicals with care. To prevent accidents, ensure that you understand how to use chemicals properly. Even hair shampoo stings if it gets in your eyes. Always read the label and follow the instructions. Read the instructions for use. Read where the product is not to be used. Look at the hazard symbol. Read the health and safety information. When diluting any Evans Vanadine product, always add the product to the water. Always wear the appropriate personal protective equipment. Store it safely, keep it clean and report any defects. After using any cleaning products, always wash and dry your hands. Advise your colleagues of unsuitable working practices. If you are unsure of how to use a cleaning product, consult your supervisor or manager. Evans Vanadine advised protecting your hands for prolonged chemical use, even when using non-hazardous products. Know and follow your company's standard operating procedures. Never mix Evans Vanadine formulated products, as this could cause a chemical reaction and produce gases which could be hazardous. Keep cleaning products in a secure place, especially away from children. Never use chemicals from unlabeled containers. Know your emergency procedures. Know where to find your material safety data sheet. Know who your first aider is and how to contact them. Only use cleaning products approved by your employer. Only use products for the purpose for which they were designed. Evans Vanadine would advise good personal hygiene practice to protect your health. After using chemicals, wash and dry your hands thoroughly. The use of barrier cream is suggested for extra protection. Who can be harmed by chemicals? People that use chemicals. Work colleagues. 
members of the public, residents and customers who are on the premises, outside workers, for example refuse collectors. Anyone can be harmed by chemicals. Everyone is primarily responsible for their own safety. Training support literature is available free of charge upon request. For more information on the full range of Evans Vanadine products, please call or visit our website.